Good morning. We're camping. Tracy's over there getting his bike ready. Yeah. We're getting ready to pack out. We're going to Elk Mountain Elk. and then to Alcova. Alcova. On the Wyoming VDR trip. So this is day three, right? Day three. Day three. There we go. Started warming up pretty quickly. Last night was actually, it got pretty cold. I'd say at least in the low 40s for sure. Um, but yeah, it was definitely nippy last night. Met up with a nice guy, Rick from uh, Michigan. He's on a 1200 GS, great guy. Lots to talk about. And yeah, I just had a really good time meeting with him and, and spent some time. So he stayed with us last night as well at the campsite. So we had a good, good, good time. Sending in to Elk Mountain. Not a bad place to stay right there. Just the only beds they have or single beds, which I can understand why it's an older place. Mountain Trading Company. Okay, here we go. We just left the Conoco here, just right outside of Elk Mountain, and we are heading out to the BDR. Here we go.
All right, so the dirt bikers led us all through. Well, let Jonathan and Tracy through. there windmill alley Hooking a right. Here we are coming in the Medicine Bow. And we're going to make a left here on 487 towards Casper. Shirley Mountain Lookout Point, and we uh, just had a nice little break, so we're heading out now. Just to finish up the rest of the day, hopefully it's a little easy. So far, the the first part of the dirt section starts off really good then it ends up getting to be a little rockier and uh, as you're going up over the mountain ridge but again it's not terrible but when it's hot outside like it is today it's a little tough a little wearing on you so um, but yeah we're gonna press on and uh, get ourselves to the campsite and alcove get us a well-deserved burger and beer and chill out. had a little stop here <clears throat> big old sand trap going around a corner which made it really difficult I almost ate it and then Tracy uh, was right behind me and ate it um, so we had to help him out and then Jonathan he uh, he actually made it through too so that was pretty good so not too much carnage I should say so the way this is going right now, we're overheated, we're exhausted. Um, it's no joke from, 
from where we camped just south of Elk Mountain to to Alcova is it's a long haul I'm not gonna lie it is it's a long run 122 miles most of it's slab but uh oh shit more sand Keep it going, Shane. Keep it going. And, uh, huh. Talk about a workout. Here we go. Uh. This is not fun, but I made it pretty far. I'm just going to nurse this softly. I don't know if you call it softly, but gracefully. Hey guys, so we actually made it to Alcova. Um, today was 120, just over 122 miles that we did. Um, we set up camp here. Obviously we're at the uh, west side of the Alcove Reservoir, Alcova, um, if I pronounced that right. Um, but yeah, let me show you here. Right there on the water. Uh, mine and Tracy's bike. We got Jonathan over here. Not a bad little spot. <laughs> 